now is quite different to the library as it was 160 years ago. It's a space for all sorts of people to come and to share knowledge and that you know first principles of access to free knowledge still underpin what we do today. Well these are some of the first books um, that are in the library's collection. So when it opened on the 11th of February 1856, these books were actually some of the books that were on the shelf for Victorians when they first entered this library. Well, this is a, a, a stunning work. This is John Gould's Birds of Australia, a very famous book. And it's really a, a it, it's one of the great Australian works and, and magnificent that this was here as a work of Australiana on the opening day. Our vision is to uh, be, the, uh, be a fantastic uh, cultural uh, agency and institution for, uh, for Victoria, for all Victorians, and a, a fantastic economic asset for Victoria as well. We at the Library Board want to make sure that the Library is as popular and as relevant and as important uh, to Victoria and to life in Victoria in 160 years time as it is today. For 160 years the State Library has been the beating heart of Melbourne and Victoria's cultural life and as a key part of our education state, as a key part of our creative economy and our knowledge economy, the State Library is really on the cusp of an exciting new era. It will be not just a place of learning, a place of gathering, a place of education, but it will increasingly become a driver of opportunities, of entrepreneurial links and of the jobs of the future that are so important in our innovative, creative economy. Oh, the library has an incredibly bright future. So 1.8 million people come here um, every year. It's one of the busiest libraries in the world. And as I say, people are coming for a range of different reasons. So into the future, we've got a redevelopment. $83 million is being spent on redeveloping the library and making sure that we have services that are much loved and relevant to audiences and to the public well into the future.